to the Frank of the kitchen. <laughs> what a new bitch. This is filthy Frank. I got my protege. Right here, I got my protege, Max the boy here. <laughs> Today we're gonna make some, uh. Oh, sh sh oh right. What? And then we got what do you want? Basic here with us. <laughs> What's next? I was supposed to take off the fucking car. Please give him some dope. Well, Fan Daniel, I made it, despite your directions. Ah, uh, my lord, welcome. I hope you're prepared for an unforgettable luncheon. Yeah. Oh, great Zodiac, my roast is ruined. But what if I were to purchase food off of the market board and disguise it as my own cooking? <laughs> Delightfully devilish, Danny boy. Uh, my lord, I was just, uh, just stretching my calves on the windowsill. Isometric exercise. Care to join me? Why is there smoke coming out of your oven, Fan Daniel? Uh, oh, that isn't smoke, it's steam. Steam from the steamed clams we're having. Mmm, steamed clams. Phew. My lord, I hope you're ready for mouth-watering hamburgers. I thought we were having steamed clams. Oh no, I said steamed hams. That's what I call hamburgers. You call hamburgers steamed hams? Yes, it's a regional dialect. What region? Uh, Northern Othard. Really? Well, I was the Viceroy of Doma, and I've never heard anyone use the phrase steamed hams. Oh, not in Doma, no. It's an Asim Step expression. I see. You know, these hamburgers are quite similar to the ones they have at the Bismarck. Oh, no. Patented Danny Burgers. Old Assian recipe. For steamed hams? Yes. And you call them steamed hams, despite the fact they are obviously grilled. Um, yeah, uh, 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 you know, the... Excuse me for one second. Of course. Well, that was wonderful. A good time was had by all. I'm pooped. Yes, I should be. Good Lord, what is happening in there? The final days? The final days. At this time of year, at this time of day, in this part of the country, localized entirely within your kitchen. Yes. May I see it? Mm, no. Fan, Daniel. The house is on fire. No, Meteon, that's just the accelerated death of the universe. Well, Fan Daniel, you are an odd fellow, but I must say you steam a good ham. Help! Fan! Daniel! Do you like cock and ball torture? What's that? You do love cock and ball torture? Well then, come on down to the den of dreams where we have. The throne of resplendent servitude, the cage of sanctified somnolescence, the crucifix of joyous screaming. Choose one of our fine ladies to abuse you, such as Replica, maid extraordinaire who will clean your house and your prostate. First I will service your home, then I will service you. Famous streamer Uulian, who is definitely a girl and not a beer boy in a maid outfit. You want mayonnaise on your sandwich? Just a little bit. Okay. Oh no. Even I'm appalled that you would do that. Just listen to one of our favorite customers' testimonies. Where hap wouldst thou find the chamber of Willy and Bollock torture? One of mine favorite pastimes with my beloved, taken long before her time, was the act of CBT. We used to engage with the blacksmith and the golden orbs of yore. But wait, if you make a booking right now, you could win a date with the lovely... Tear. <laughs> At any restaurant of your choosing for only 10 million gil. And who knows, maybe she'll acknowledge your existence. Call now. Make your booking and go in for a chance to win. And to avoid scalpers and creeps, we require a vocal confirmation from any and all entrants. Also, no face when auras. Hello, Den of Dreams. Where making you come is our number one goal. This is Sophia. How may I help you? Here are some tips to improve your next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe. The bra sound effect. Bruh. An instant classic. The super zoom. Another funny meme. Listen, mister. 
I'm not into the whole breathing heavy into the phone thing. It's going to get complicated. Do pay attention. I much prefer Vera men with iconic red shirts who spread misinformation online and rely on a girl like me to give them the purpose and love they cannot provide themselves. I apologize. I literally just learned how to speak. I don't need a booking. I just want to enter the competition to have a date with Tyr. Shut up! Is there a limit? If you're not gonna participate in the group activity, then leave! Zephyr, I'm making a very important call on my tombstone. Be quiet. Apologies, Sophia. That was a very loud acquaintance of mine. Now, what is the maximum amount of entries I can buy? I will pay Never give up. Believe in yourself and treat yourself with the love and kindness you deserve. What the fuck is happening? Oh, fuck yeah! This is the shit! It's been a long time. Decades. Since the Silver Samurai was last seen. Three books. The Way of the Bushido. Crescent Moon. That's book one. Our tale starts off. The Silver Samurai is engaged in combat with the Crimson Samurai, arch enemies. The Nemesis. Battling on a mountaintop, the proving ground, surrounded by cherry blossom trees. The thunder cracks. hits the two warriors hard as their swords clash. The Silver Samurai takes his stance. I am ready. dead. The Crimson Samurai bleeds out on the Proving Grounds. Rain hits the warrior hard. Cold that day. Thunder cracks. The Silver Samurai sheaths his weapon. He knows he is one. He walks away. He walks away from the Crimson Samurai. Knowing that one day he will return to do battle with him again. But until then, Silver Samurai is waiting. If that isn't the most alpha shit I've ever seen in my life, then I don't know what is. Okay, mister. That's every single entry that was available. Thank you, Sophia. You've been very helpful. I hope you find your dream Vieira boyfriend with the iconic red shirt you so desire as soon as possible. Well, mister, if you happen to know somebody, then I'd love to give him my unconditional love and a- It's a shame I don't know a Vieira man who likes concupiscent Mikote girls with massive breasts, who wears an iconic red shirt and is very needy and unintelligent. Leon, Hayate, I haven't been on a date in a long time, and never with a girl like Tyr. Can you help me? I know that you are always getting attention from girls. Hayate. And Leon. Well, you dress nicely. What with that iconic red shirt of yours? Maybe you could help me choose something to wear?
Leon told me that in order to access his glamour dresser, I must speak the ancient magics. Here goes. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Please torture my cock and balls. <laughs> hmm, that didn't work. Which is strange, but Leon said to trust him and that it would totally work, bro. And you won't look absolutely spastic whilst I film you and put you on YouTube. Whatever that means. I'll just have to try again. Do it for Tear. Do it for those boobies, those massive fucking titties, those super stuffed up milkies, those honger bonger. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Please torture my cock and balls. Wow, that intro really was something. If you are joining us right at this moment, this season of Irzia's Finest, the show that is definitely not a ripoff of The Bachelorette, features the lovely Felicity. She's a wonderful sunseeker Mikote that's just modded enough to look amazing and not like an abomination from IMVU. On the show, Felicity will be presented with a line of bachelors who must win her affection. Will she go for looks? Will I'm she go really for money? I'm really excited to be on the go... show. Okay, I'm hoping uh, I can I find the perfect man for me. And if these men are yours yes finest, then I'm can sure I'll be spoilt for choice. Now, oh, there's another page, but what about the part I had to... Introducing... Yours is finest. No. joking i want to see your boobs i want to see listen buddy i don't care i'm so sick of women not getting the respect they deserve are you recording me stop it's too hot in this no more starbucks i don't want no money i don't want no no fame no notoriety nothing all i want is to be neck deep in pussy my brother i've got the muscles ladies love me i've got a big willy what more could they want? This is why the other races don't like us! What the fuck is this show? Why can't I just find myself a handsome Sierra man with an iconic red shirt already? And with that, we bring an end to this season of the show. Felicity has run off, and the men will be uh, lined up and executed by firing squad. Goodbye. The brand new burger you can fuck. This burger is better than sex. You can fuck this burger. I'm pitching and shitting and coming. Your balls will explode, guaranteed. You can come inside, outside. I am the cum lord. This burger will make your skin soft and your asshole tight. Our estrogenizing burgers will give you tits the size of basketballs. And that's no cap. Mirror, mirror on the wall. Please torture my cock and balls. How do I look? So then I killed Omega and got this amazing sword. Why do boys always think we care about stuff like this? When I'm on the back foot. Just an hour more and then I get my gill and I can go. And with that, I'm able to win any battle. That's how I can afford all of You know that shirt do be looking kind of nice, though? I just wait over there. Um, it's the, um, oh wait, come on, I'm blanking, um. What's wrong, Yishtola? You've barely touched that scrumptious looking pizza. I miss him is all. I miss his body odor, and how when we kissed, I could feel his missing teeth. At least he is alive and breathing, and he will one day return to paint your cavernous minge with Azerothian seed, you traitor. That's not very nice, but I guess it is true. They don't call you the spittoon of Limsa for nothing. Did I ever tell you that you oh, are a Oh, silence, Yishtola. You are about as deep and interesting as a fimble of feces. People only like you because you are a woman. Good morning, Brev. I would like to show you my morning routine. The first thing I do after I wake up is have a shower and brush my teeth. Some people don't brush their teeth in the morning and that's why their breath smells like willy and dog shit. Then I cream my skin. Some people don't cream their skin, bruv, and that's why they get dick cheese and smegma. Like, are you dumb? Are you getting rude to me? That's what you get, fam. Push you. I also practice scenarios in my head just in case someone tries to take me for a dickhead breath. Then I look at myself in the mirror and deep how buff I am. It's a bit zesty, but if you don't love yourself, who will breath?
need Fucking help. Fucking move! 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 Why don't you move? I've got you on fucking camera! Go on! I've got you on fucking camera! Look what you fucking done! You walk down here, I'm trying to get past, there's loads of space for you to walk there! You just fucking smacked my car! I also have PTSD. Penis that needs sucking disorder. <laughs> and the only cure is a set of juicy DSLs that could suck a cannonball through a hose. And it looks like I need to take the village vacuum for a spin. <laughs> Then point at her. Also, don't say the parts in brackets BTWXD. Like, this is normal. What do you keep looking at? I'm looking at my tombstone. My friends are giving me advice because I've never been on a date with such a. a beautiful. lady. They're sitting over there. The one with the magnificent and iconic red shirt is Leon. Stack of egg. And the one with white hair speaking Hingen is Hayate. What do you mean he's speaking Hingen? He's speaking Japanese? Are you like hardcore into your RP or something? What is RP? Wait, do you not have a. This exchange is over. Look at me, my beautiful friends, who I love ever so much. I'm on a boat. I wonder what fantastic new world I would discover beyond yonder horizon if I were to follow the trail of dawn. Um, I have to go. Please never talk to me again or watch my stream. Goodbye. Hmm. It may not have worked out, but at least the den of dreams gave me back my gill. Now to search for the woman who will provide sweet anodyne for the tragedy of existence. Oh, you know, just Google big boob. Did Leon mean Google, the great library? I thought it was sealed because of Garlean invasion, but maybe they do have some lecherous erotica that they wouldn't want anyone to get their hands on. I don't understand him or his strange accent sometimes, but he's harmless and his heart is in the right place. Your gullibility will be the death of you, Nihil. Just because he wears the most beautiful shirt that shimmers the fairest and most iconic red I have ever set my eyes upon, does not make him worthy of your trust. Yet you conjure up falsehoods to toy with me and beguile Tyr into a nympholepsy. Tyr was not interested in weaponry or fighting, or you for that matter. Money will not win her affection, and neither will the horrific dribble those brothers were giving you to read. I exist to make you happy and to obtain for you whatever you want. You wanted her, and because of me, she was wrapped around your finger. Until something broke the spell, that is. Giving you your voice and making up for your friend's antics has left me hungry. So let's reminisce together whilst I devour something. Oh my fucking god, oh magnificent so bad. Cheater, cheater, cheater broken eater, you may have defeated us before, but this time it will be different. Why is this the memory you always choose? It will play out the same every time. It's a special moment. The first time you laid eyes upon her. And I'd like to see if one day you have it in you. To kill her. <laughs>